Yeah. All right, yo, wait, wait, what's this called, John? This is called Vasquez Rocks. Yo. We film a lot of movies and stuff here and other stuff like that. What's up? Um, what's your first opinion when you look at this? I think it looks pretty beautiful, you know, it, coming from Florida. I think it we looks don't really got cool. Like it looks really cool. Yeah. All right, guys, let's, let's go up top and see what everything looks like from up there. Oh, that looks so sick. Alright, we made it. Woke up. You good? Are we live oh. right now, bro? We're live. Guys, look how freaking high we are. Yeah, let me see. We're really not that high, Wait. dude. Okay. We're really like not that high, but uh you might be high. Alright, here you go. Okay guys, uh. so uh. James is on crack. <laughs> guys, I possibly shouldn't have wore these shoes, but uh, you know what? We're going with it. This is my view from this from this location right now. Wow, we're so high right now. <laughs> we're so high. Like, we're so high. Okay. <laughs> Alright guys, so that's where we got- oh my god. We've got to go all the way up here. And uh, let's see what the view looks like from there. Hey guys, we're making a run for it all the way up this hill in our dress shoes, man. Not sure what the heck I was thinking. Hopefully the wind isn't too bad here as well. Well, this is gonna be sick. All right, guys. So right now we're on Vasquez Rocks. Yep. And uh, show them like what we're kind of on right now. This is where we're kind of chilling at. You get like the whole view of basically all this desert and everything. It looks pretty cool. Figured I'd show you guys. This is what uh, this is what's below me here. A little fall into the rocks. So hopefully we don't fall down. And uh, we're taking a lot of cool pictures right now. <laughs> And now the way down, guys. It's so difficult. I don't know why I decided to wear dress shoes to climb up a little mountain. That was a bit silly of me. Okay, let's see what we can do here. All right, let's do a little something like this. Oh. All right, we're good. Yeah, I'm vlogging. <laughs> I'm vlogging the struggle. Okay, let's do a little something like this. Oh, that is steep. We're going. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, we good, Doug. Okay, okay, guys. For those of you guys who have been here with me for the first time ever, I really don't talk like that, so please don't um, think that. <laughs> but uh, you know, we're uh, Jonathan like oh Jonathan wow. like Jonathan likes to like troll people and talk it, like that. I okay, mean, it's like a lot more comfortable. If I told somebody, I'm like, hi there, your shoes untied. It's a lot more comfortable doing it in that voice. Cause then it just feels more natural. Yeah guys, so we're back at the house. This is my little setup that I got going on here. I got my dad's laptop here. And uh, normally these light up. I'm not too sure why they're not lighting up right now, but whatever. Um, we got the laptop there. This is the mouse I use. In case you guys were actually wondering, I use the Logitech G502. Do a little jitter click action. That's how I jitter click. Um, Yep, this is the whole setup here, guys. Just on this table here, just chilling. I got it plugged into the wall over there. Um, Noah is gonna be leaving soon, so I'll be sure to get the goodbyes on the camera. All right, guys. So as you see, I am in a new place. This is just a hope. Oh, John! I swear to God, man. <laughs> guys, we're in a new place. We're in a hotel right now. We got, we got, we got a bed here. We got a bed there. We're all sharing beds. It's kind of weird, but we're doing it. Um, but yeah, TwitchCon is today, and I wanted to get some footage for you guys. Hopefully I can get enough, because I think I only brought one of my batteries. Um, but I should be able to get enough for you guys, because I'm going to get a charger as well. So, yeah guys, if you guys do enjoy these, uh, these vlogs and everything like that, be sure to hit that like button, and, uh, let's go. Alright guys, I just made it to TwitchCon. We got Jake right Hello. here. We got Richard. We got Eddie. Oh, wait, what? Where's the pay for parking? Oh, okay. Um, yeah guys, but this is the whole arena right here. There's gonna be literally probably like 10 times the people that are at freaking Minecon. Actually, probably not 10 times because there was like 12,000 people there. There's gonna be a good amount. Yeah, there's gonna be a good amount of people because, I mean, Minecon is limited to one game and Twitch is just literally every game. So there's gonna be a crap ton of people. <laughs> Yo.
Yo guys, I don't know how well you can hear me, but one thing I do have to say, I met Tretzi, I don't know if you guys know who he is, I forgot to take a picture with him, which kind of upsets me, but I'll make sure to take some more pictures with actually well-known people so that you guys can, can, so that you guys can see proof that I met them. Yeah guys, so right now we're just walking around, we just met Summit, I'll show you a picture of him on the screen right now. But uh, right now we're actually going to go take a look at a lot of the merchandise that they have because apparently this line gets pretty long. Oh god. Yeah guys, the line's already pretty big. I don't even know if we can check out what they have, but uh, we're going to try. Try Hex. Alright guys, so there's two people in front of me that are in these fat suits right now. And they're about to 1v1, so here we go, here we go. Alright. We got the guy in the red going to be taking on the blue hat. Let's see what happens here. Oh god. Oh! <laughs> oh! Damage gonna be taken there, Jonathan. What do you have to say about that fight? No, I think that that was an interesting one to say the least. Hopefully, we're gonna have a better round two because that was way too quick. Let's take a look. All right, here we go, guys. Round two is about to start. Just gonna be fixing up the suit here. Um, it looks like Red did obviously take the lead on that one. Yeah, Red is ahead right now, but we're ho hoping that he's gonna be able to redeem himself in round two. And it oh! Like it's gonna happen, and Red, you gotta take him down again. Absolutely, Red is just absolutely dominating this fight here. You gotta wonder, you know, is this guy actually an experienced fighter, or is he just a rookie? You know, so far, I think the answer is no. From what I can tell, we gotta take a look at this, though. All right, here we go. Not gonna be trying to do something. Oh! He does. He does take him down, redeeming himself. <laughs> now it's a one to two, two for Red, one black. <laughs> I think this could be the very well could be the end right here. Yep, definitely, definitely getting a lot better as you see. He knocked him out of the arena here, almost into us actually. Definitely. So this is a this is an interesting situation yet again. I think they're done. I think it's done. Are they done? Win by default. Two to one default win right there. Yo guys, I'm at Starbucks right now. I'm gonna try it for my first time because of this guy right here. Starbucks addict himself. Yeah, he is. Um, but yeah, guys, we're gonna try it for our first time. I'm gonna film my reaction. We good? We good? All right, we good. All right, let's go. <laughs> you don't like it? <laughs> what? Uh, try another sip. You got it. Come on, come on. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Chug, 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 chug. I'd give it maybe a 3 out of 10. <laughs> what? Wait, who, whose house is this? Like, San Matato? Okay. Oh yeah, can they even see me? Yo guys, I'm at San Matato's house right there. This is the this is the owner right there. And I mean, I guess a bunch of other guys paid for it as well. But uh, we're on the balcony. This is everything that you can see right now. I'll do a little, uh, I'll do a little thing for you guys. It's pretty freaking sick. This is the whole view from like the upper level. Um, and then the inside of the house is just really, really cool as well. 